This video is about our YouTube journey on the way to 1,000 subscribers and also aims to provide inspiration to anyone who wants to start their own channel. This is not our typical style video, but it's something I have been wanting to share for a while now. This is for people who might be interested in following our path. I uploaded our first YouTube video in September 2020. The goal was to have a place where I could capture the things that happened in our lives. My son Jackson and I went on our first private scuba spearfishing charter in the Florida Keys. We had been certified open divers for a few years now, but this was our introduction to spearfishing. I watch this video every few months and it always makes me emotional, but in a good way. We have discovered something that we are both passionate about and I can slowly see him growing up. Kim and I watched this video the other evening on our family room TV and we couldn't stop laughing because of how shaky it was. I kept telling her there's no way that I record the video that shaky. The color's terrible, but hey, this was my first spearfishing trip with Jackson and we put dinner on the table. <laughs> The first few videos we shot with a GoPro alternative camera since I had lost my previous GoPro in the Keys a year prior. After this video, I uploaded a couple more with Kim and I out at Fort DeSoto. <laughs> To me, these are fancy home videos. Growing up as a kid, both my dad and grandpa had these big Panasonic VHS camcorders. These things were huge. I remember it came with a storage case, it had a fuzzy microphone, and this viewfinder thing that you'd look into while recording. We had hours of home video growing up. My parents would record our birthday parties, us opening presents at Christmas, and even taking this thing on vacation. My sister and I would use a camera to record ourselves doing these little skits around the house. If you want your hair nice, fresh, and smelling clean, use house stuff. Oops, I forgot to stop it. Oh, Jason! We also discovered a trick we could do while making our videos. I'm here to talk to you about Jason's new Peppa. Here, let me show you. Oh my goodness! It's the wrong Peppa! This is the right Peppa. Toilet Peppa! So, you could say this is something I have always enjoyed doing. YouTube has helped me discover something that I didn't know I was passionate about. Making videos. Fast forward to 2023. This is when I made the decision to upload more videos to YouTube. At first, I was going to upload videos on cooking. Today... Woohoo! What the hell? Cooking is another passion of mine, but I was not passionate about making cooking videos. It's really difficult to do when you're trying to focus on cooking something and recording it at the same time. Kim and I had recently bought a boat and I had decided to record some of our daily lives together. If the weather is good on the weekend, chances are we're going to be on the boat. The video, What Floridians Do on the Weekend, is the first video I uploaded showing what we actually did on the weekend. I put more effort into this video by using Adobe Premiere with music and a little voiceover. We continued to make videos like this and tried to improve each one. Honestly, we make these videos for ourselves and enjoy sharing our lifestyle. Each video is special to us in its own unique way. Every video I watch brings back memories of that day and I reminisce. YouTube is a platform that has allowed me to express my creativity and share with people around the world. I have also started journaling. This is something that I had not been interested in doing in the past, but now I write down all my thoughts and ideas so I can reflect on them and possibly create a video based on those thoughts. This YouTube journey is a time for self-discovery. I don't compare myself to other content creators on YouTube. However, I can appreciate their content and learn from them. Now I have an appreciation for how much time and effort can go into creating one video. I've been watching videos on YouTube for years. YouTube is my go-to for just about everything. Need to replace your brake pads? YouTube has a video. Want to watch an underwater camera, a fish swimming under a pier? YouTube has it. In each one of these videos, someone has taken the time to create it and upload it. 
Kim and I both have nine to five jobs and we work on this in our free time. Sometimes we record content and don't make a video at all. It just really depends on how we are feeling. I can tell you this, after I create a video, I always say to myself, this is the best one yet. Even if the video doesn't get many views, it's still the best one. We also discuss different shots we can record to make the video fun and more interesting. But most of the time, it's just us being ourselves and documenting our lives together. If you are considering starting a YouTube channel, be like Nike and just do it. It's never too late to start. Kim and I are both in our 40s. If we can do this, so can you. All you have to do is just hit record. Record something that you're passionate about, something that you enjoy. Don't overanalyze things. Just start making content and upload it. It can be whatever you're doing at that time, just like what I'm doing right now. I do have a clear, meaningful goal for this channel, and that's to become monetized. While it's true that the prospect of earning income through our YouTube content is enticing, it's essential to emphasize that it's not solely about the money, rather it's about achieving a personal milestone that I have set out to accomplish. Even if we do get monetized, it might not be anything life-changing, but hopefully you'll buy a round of drinks for Kim and I on YouTube. At the time of recording this video, our channel has a steadily growing community of 439 subscribers and a total of 2,000 watch hours. While these numbers might not seem extraordinary in the grand scheme of the vast YouTube platform, they represent significant progress and dedication in our journey. We understand that building a successful YouTube channel is an ongoing journey that requires time, effort, and continuous improvement. We will persistently do what we have been doing all along, creating videos with our passion for Florida, boating, and in just enjoying life. Each video we produce is a labor of love, a piece of our lives captured and shared with the world. Every upload is an opportunity for us to engage with our audience, spark conversations, and inspire others to do the same thing. Our dreams extend beyond the videos we create. While we're currently enjoying boating in the waters of Florida, we envision a future where we set sail on a sailboat, exploring the ICW, and eventually sailing down to the Florida Keys. Who knows, maybe one day we'll even get a catamaran. In conclusion, while the road to monetization is a part of our YouTube journey, it's just one facet of fulfilling the path we are traveling. We cherish every moment, every subscriber, and every view, and we're committed to continuing our voyage, making videos that resonate, and pursuing our dreams both on and off the screen. This is the best one yet.